Okay, John Peretti, founder of BuzzFeed. What are your five rules for making something go viral? How, how much time do I have? <laughs> 30 seconds, go. 30 seconds, five rules. Uh, make things that work on the Board at Work Network. There's all these board office workers that spend half their day just forwarding stuff around. So if you can make something that those ordinary board office workers like, it'll go viral. Um, use the mullet strategy where you put the business up front and the party in the back. So put, you know, if you're managing a site or a blog, put the serious stuff up there, but also have like the popcorn and the fun kind of hiding behind. Um, use big seed marketing if you're a brand. So spend some money um, to get your your campaigns out there. Make really good, really good creative campaigns. Spend some money to get them out there, and then you get the social viral lift for free. Um, and um, BuzzFeed has a platform for managing that, so we do that for a whole bunch of big brands. Um, work, um, 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 work, target your stuff for maniacs because crazy people run the web. So. People like Mike Arrington or Perez Hilton or Lady Gaga or Kanye, you know, they're people who aren't like just sitting back on their couch passively watching TV. They're the kind of people who see stuff and pass it around and get in fights and get in arguments and stir stuff up. So those are the people you want to reach um, on the web. And uh, I forget Mormons. ones. Oh, Mormons. So I, I have to like get a graph here to like add to this video. I'll, I'll send it to you. But, um, you know, if you look at. Um, which is better, Mormons or Judaism? Mormonism or Judaism? Now they're both pretty high quality religions, but Jews suck at marketing. It's like they don't even want other people to be Jews. Um, meanwhile, Mormons, they have a mission for two years where they go and try to convert people. Mormons actually are like affiliate marketers. They keep track of their conversion rates and try to get the conversion rates higher and higher. Um, and that's why if you look from 1950 to now, there used to be very few Mormons, and they have this nice exponential growth curve, kind of like a, a, a Facebook. And the Jews have kind of flat growth, you know, going sideways. And so, so you have to remember it's not just the quality of your idea, because Judaism is a great quality religion. It's also having a strategy for spreading and passing it on and making it um, spread spread across to other people and evangelizing. Great. Well, there you go. All right. Thanks a lot. <laughs>